do up quite easily, but I just can't get my fingers to work. Still remember? Yes. <laughs> how are we artists? I don't know. How yeah. do we live? How do we function? Just in general. Mm. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, or welcome if you're new. Um, this is CJ. You Hi. may or may not recognize her if you watched uh, any of my Japan vlogs or what do I call it? Tokyo Art Skirt. Tokyo Art Skirt. Yeah. <laughs> we did a thing. Yeah. So uh, today we are doing an unboxing of the Etcha Art Satchel, <sighs> which is this bad boy. Yay. And it's been sitting in my living room for. I don't know, like a month? I think a month. A long time. And every time I walk past it, it's like... Play with me! Open Use me! me. Open me! <laughs> and I haven't had time to do it until now. So, I already uh, took the liberty of cutting it open because as you guys know from other unboxings, that usually goes terribly wrong in videos. Um, yeah. And I'm learning, slowly. Mm. <laughs> also, if you're wondering why CJ's in the video, uh, she has her very own art satchel from Etcha. And of course, I wasn't doing a video with it, so I could open mine immediately. <laughs> and she's got all her stuff in it. And so all of my stuff's in it. That way you can kind of see how it's used. Um, and yeah. how much random things you can put inside it. That, that looks like it weighs the same amount as you. Yeah, uh, not quite. <laughs> it is pretty heavy though. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, also... Yeah, I, so I know Darren who uh, runs, makes Etcha, makes mm. Etcha? Makes bags at Etcha? I'm only friends with him because he makes cool bags. Clearly not because he's an awesome person and artist. Mm. Mm. Anyway, not sponsored. I'm very biased already because I've seen the prototypes that he had. I've seen the videos. I know I'm going to love it. Um, so if you're wanting a bashing video, go somewhere else. Anyway. I don't think, I don't think I've seen a anyone, video bash of anyone say anything negative about this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh my, it's already heavy. It's, he it's heavy <laughs> bag. Da, da, da. Box go down there. That would be it smells it. like new. It does smell like new. <laughs> yes, my, mine does smell like new. I have that smell. It'll smell like Loki in that. Yeah, I was about to say, it minutes. will smell like Loki. And it will also be covered in Loki. Well, I don't know. It's waterproof, so maybe uh, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, his fur might not it. actually stick to it. Although, that's a problem because I was like, I want to paint this and like make it pretty colours, but it's waterproof. <laughs> Just attach cool key rings. Well, that's good. So. As you can see, it's got lots of compartments and things where you can attach stuff. Um, and it has like, if you guys look up the um, Etcha, I think it's Etcha Lab YouTube yeah. account. Um, they've actually got a video on like how to, the word I want to use is majig, and that's not the word. The majig. Well, the different. See, there's a low key. There's a low key. He's helping and begging for configure? modes. Configure. Modes. modes? Yeah. They call it mode. There you go. Because I often use it in laptop mode. There you go. So the different ways you can set it up um, to draw on and put your art supplies in it. Which we can kind of demonstrate with yours, well, but it has nothing in it and it's going to be easy to do things. True. Mine, on the other hand, has stuff. Yeah. Um, so maybe we should show everyone what's in my, yours. My mess of a bag. Yes. Um, and then maybe we can show them what modes it can be put in. It's, it's, it's heavy. <laughs> I'm just like, why did I put that on I still think it weighs as much as her. <laughs> so my little front pack here. Has a whole lot of watercolor stuff in it. Like, I'm a little a bit obsessed with watercolors. Those are so cute. Like, a lot obsessed. Look at little danglies. Yeah, little danglies. Because yeah. you hold on to that. So you have most of them have it's that. Like on this. phones. Yeah, like on phones. So you could actually hold on to it because you have that on your phone. Even that, even the Holbein one that we got that I got in Japan. Even that has it. Random and My cute. My phone has a pop socket now. Yes. I think that's better for your phone. Yes. And Although I did it. throw it across the room accidentally today anyway, so... <laughs> Clearly she didn't need that. I was gesturing to absolutely no one for no reason with my phone in my hand. That, that's how that works. And I have a sketchbook. <laughs> we hit... I'm just going to give up on that. Um, I'm going to blame Casey, Beck and Emma for talking on Facebook while I'm trying to film. Yes. <laughs> yes. We will blame them. I mean, you could have closed the page down, but no, it still them. makes the noise. I have to turn the computer off. It does. I don't know how to fix it. I did not know that. It's so like, it's so annoying. <laughs> anyway, clearly, I don't know how to use Facebook. Tangent. And I have like Blender stuff for my colored pencils because I use a lot of colored pencils. I 
and sharpener and randomly my mini tripod in. And then this was just in here for my stuff. But that's another thing that you can actually add. And you can move that around too, can't you? Yeah, because I have had it up there, but that annoyed me at one stage, so I took it out. And I have my four little thingies for my sketchbook. So you like put your sketchbook in here. Sorry! <laughs> actually, let me change the camera angle on there. That would work. Okay. I know you just got up here. And yes, then I have a whole lot of random stuff attached to the front of, the front of mine with um. you guys. Oh! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> um, hang on. I have a whole lot of stuff in this bit. And the good thing about that is you can also remove that oh, and that's take that cool. out. So that's totally removable and, that's and you can that, move like, that around. That's the same stuff. That's wizard technology again. <laughs> yep. It was, it is. And so yes, I have lots of things. Lots of fun stuff. My watercolour brushes and random stuff. And I've got a sketchbook hiding in there. Another sketchbook because, you know, always a sketchbook. Nice. That's fun. And yeah, so that Velcro to itself as well, which is good because, you know, knowing me, I'll lose it. But yeah, yeah that is my bag. Yay. Lots of things in it. Hi. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> you're just going to have to deal with blurry me because I can't be bothered fiddling with the... Too loud. <laughs> yeah, the focus took ages. Okay, anyway. <laughs> so, um, we're going to do the easel mode first. I guess so. Yeah, I think you that's have, You have the tripod yeah. set. Yes, so this is easel mode, I think is what it's called. Mm. I could be wrong. On the back here, you can see there's like a little, I don't know what the technical term is, but it's the twisty thing that twists your camera yes. to the thing. Totally. <laughs> and if your tripod has one, or in this case, your light stand, I'm just gonna keep twirling. <laughs> Well, so, God. <laughs> so, in theory now, if I wanted to draw CJ, I could. Now, if I have an easy, if I had an actual tripod, I could tip it, but because it's just a light stand, I don't have that. Don't have the tip of the tip of thing. But it, this would sit like here, and then you could draw on it like an easel. And have all your stuff below you, so you can actually, you know. Yeah. Um, and then the other way you can do it is called laptop mode. Where? So randomly, yeah. it's not on an easel. <laughs> you can do it on an easel or for easel. Yeah. Um, I need the little taggy things which are hiding inside. In here. Um, so these have like a little hook on them, and there's little loopy things hiding. I don't know if you guys can see them. There's little, little hoops. Yeah, the bag also does this. Hiding. <laughs> yeah, so if you're leaning on it and that gets in the way, you can like, when you're drawing. Anyway. <laughs> so, you hook one of these to the bottom little loopy magic. So I hooked one to the bottom, and one to the top. And then it sits. You do both sides, obviously. But I can't be bothered. <laughs> yeah. And you can sit it like this, and you can either have like your art supplies here, or if you're using some kind of reference, you can have that there, and then like your drawing stuff down here. Or if you want to draw up here and then have this as like a table for your supplies, like your paint palettes and stuff, you can do that. So that's laptop mode. And you can also do this uh, off the easel, obviously, so like sitting on your lap. Ways of carrying it, you can do backpack mode, which is obviously like this. And then you can also change it to do satchel mode, which you unclip. There's two little clips up the top here. Unclip those. And then you unhook this D ring, which is the bottom one, and rehook it to the top D ring. And then you clip these together. And then wizard technology clip those. So I guess it's nice on your shoulder. Yep. So you don't have a clip digging into your shoulder. And it actually is comfy. Such a mood. Actually, it's really comfy. It is comfy. This is all really nice and squishy. I guess because they're expecting us artists to carry a stuff that's the same of... weight as us. Yeah. Uh, and then you can also do what we still aren't sure what to call it, but I'm going to attempt to call it like freestanding drawing right. mode. Um, there's like a little teeny tiny adorable clip here and there. And it's going to confuse you because you're going to want to go this way, but you actually want to go this way. If it properly, that would work. That's future cat's problem. Getting rid of everything's future cat's problem. Yeah, true. 
And I'm just gonna tighten that up. Like yeah. So then let's do this. No, it's still that way. This way. Well, either anyway, really. And you want it uh depends on whether oh, this is what we we're talking about before. This thing, because if you're like drawing on here, the zip will get stuck. So you can actually push it down. Inside out bag. It depends on if you're right or left handed. You, If you're right handed, like me, you hook the bottom D ring on your right side and the top D ring on your left side, which is hiding under here. And then you want to add a bit before you put it over your head. I'm going to lengthen this because I'm not a, a tiny child man. Man? Not a man at all. <laughs> as far as I know. <laughs> anyway. So you can hook it like this. And then now, if I wanted to like walk around and draw. We can. Obviously not like this, because that would be difficult for my legs. But <laughs> you can draw like this. I can walk around. Small, okay. <laughs> it's no space. There really isn't. And it's. Really I'm amazed she gets as much artwork as she does in here done. It's really messy too. <laughs> That's okay. You are an artist. <laughs> here looks fine. I think there. There looks terrible. It's actually not that bad. It does look like an artist studio. So she's she's playing it up more than it actually is. But she's fine. <laughs> I'm a real artist. <laughs> So the other cool thing, well, I think it's cool, and I can't. Is it llama mode? Yes. This is llama mode. <laughs> Yay! She's happy. <laughs> I like llamas. All right. So these little. This is this is the front pocket. Pocket. Yes. Pocket. Flap. 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 Yeah. So these little hooky jigs. You can actually put um, like your tripod, or you know, if you're doing easel mode somewhere, um, or I don't know, a cylinder of watercolor yep. paper or something. So this is my light stand or, or your, my easel. Or your seat, like we. Oh yeah, yeah. Like we when we were in Japan, shifted. yeah, we had uh, little seats. You did a very clever makeshift with that. Uh, and you just tighten these up. Right, and they've got um, wizard technology there, but uh, mine. I didn't do my little bit too yours. small. But you get the idea. And then you can lengthen and these. The same magical little guide on to, that one. But, uh, Hook those up. But yeah, I played with it. my big case for my polyus, polychromos. Mm. Actually, I can llama mode that. So, oh, cool. So if I wanted to have that separate outside the bag, I could shove it in there and actually. So it like sits within here. Yeah, it's that's really in there. Cool. And it comes out to like this thick. <laughs> These are huge. Hey, it still works. And I was like, hmm, it's not <laughs> moving. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you can carry it like that. Which is pretty cool. And then there's, let's say you've got um, you know, like polychromos or something already in here in llama mode. Um, if you still want to carry your tripod, you can actually use these um, or I guess, yeah, use those. And then these are already yeah, that's, holding something that's in. That's llama mode. That's yeah. right. Yeah, holding those in. So you pull these ones out, and there's actually what they call mollies in here. You can thread them through there. And then pop him on there. Pop him on there and clip them over the top. You can still carry him. Probably not. Oh, it'd still work in backpack mode. Yeah, it would. It's really cool. Anyway, <laughs> it totally works in backpack mode. I mean, you better hang it off the bottom, I guess, in backpack mode. Yeah, on the side. Mm. Oh, yeah, because they're everywhere. Yeah, they're all the way around. So that's the uh, Etcher Art Satchel. Um, as I said, I'm really biased. I already knew that I was gonna love this thing and nerd over it, so sorry. Obsessed. I mean, it was, it's an unboxing. It's not a review. <laughs> I mean, this is not a review. This is, this, is, this is us showing shiny new toys. Yeah. Um, I'm actually going camping next weekend, so I'm going to set this one up for me and use it while I'm camping. I may or may not film. I I can't promise that. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this one. Um, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up so I know you should do more stuff like this. 
And if you want to check out more of my videos and you like those, please subscribe. I'd love to have you. Um, if you want to see some of my artwork, you can follow the social media links down below. Um, if you want to get your own Etcha Art Satchel, or they even do a feel case. Is that what the other one's they called? They do. It's like a little, little cute uh, like wallet version. Wallet size almost, yeah, because it's like, like a that, that big. Yeah, it's, it's really cute. You can't really fit sketchbooks in it, but um, you no, can you put. Can. Yeah, little, I think, like think kind of A5 y thing. Okay, yeah. you can do A5 sketchbooks um, and like art supplies and stuff. And if you get this and that, apparently you can actually like. Llama mode each. They llama mode in together, yeah. It's like a, um, a transformer. <laughs> in wizard technology. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I'll pop, <laughs> I'll pop the link down below to these guys as well. And if you want to see any of CJ's artwork, she's an amazing pencil artist and other things, you can find her link down below as well. Thank you so much for joining me. That's okay, it was lots of fun. <laughs> it's not a thing I do, filming, but yay! <laughs> I forced her into it in Japan, so I think I've broken her now. Yeah, maybe. Don't be friends with me. <laughs> I was already broken. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and on that note, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! I'll get there eventually. Where is... Well, you have more strength oh, in your yeah. hands than I do, so you're ready. I managed to bruise here by arm yeah. wrestling someone the other day. Why were you... Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, that's... That, I mean, that is a question you need to ask. Why were you arm wrestling somebody, <laughs> but at the same time, like, no, I really don't need to. <laughs> they issued a challenge! Mm. <laughs> and I was like... I'll probably no, lose, but I'll take you. <laughs> cool. Sorry, hi, mate, mother. Like, challenge accepted. Not a challenge. <laughs> Every time. <laughs>